How's it going, guys? I'm Tiddlywinks, and welcome to Imaginal. This is a short little game about catching fireflies. It sounds like it's just a cute little relaxing type thing, so let's go ahead and catch our first. I swear I once saw a blue lightning bug. No one believed me. They thought I was full of it. I probably was full of it. So this is mostly played by mouse? Hey, so apparently each night goes is like a seven minute thing. Jeez, these guys are fast. I remember playing hunting firebugs when I was little. I loved it. Such a fun thing. And you know, here in the last oops, few years, I've noticed that they've all kind of disappeared. There's not as many as there used to be of a night. And they, when I was little, I was just caught and release. Oh, come on. So I can like scroll around them a little bit, I guess? Yeah. There we go. Let's get them all in one area here. Come on. There we go. This is really pretty. And it is kind of a nice relaxing game. Where are you going to be the next one? No? This, no not quite fast enough. There we go. Look how many I've caught. Uh, let's see. Whoosh, got you. Almost went fast enough. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So, how have you guys been? You know, sometimes it's nice to play these little relaxing, silly games like this. There you go, little guy. There you are. Just take a few minutes. I mean, this might be even a good game to play. Like a vlog or something. I want to I wanna start doing that a little bit. Give an update to the channel. You know. Thanks for 25 subscribers. Shit like that. Which, by the way, thank you very much for 25 subscribers. I'm really excited to have made that first little mini milestone. Looking forward to 50 and maybe eventually 100. Ah! So many! Okay, there's one around here somewhere. There you are, little fella. Oh, they've respawned or did I just miss a bunch? There we go, and there's one up here somewhere. There he is. How about you? I think they respawn. Let's continue on. Instead of going back. Oh. Ooh, a blue one. Sometimes I'll see a palm frond in the, in the road and think it's a dead animal, and my heart jumps. Then I realize it's just a palm frond. The str stress still lingers. Now when I see... Any wayward palm fronds, I think about this and get a little distressed. It's a bad loop. Okay, that's interesting. So I guess the, the blue ones give us a little bit of storyline? Come on. Ooh, one more. It looks like they just kind of repopulate after a while. I've reached the end of the level. Come on. I'm gonna grab you. Then we'll go back and we'll collect over here. Hello. Come on. Pretty little friends. I think there might be a blue one over here. They're not really wanting to light up now, are they? Another one. Come on. I see you. I see you. Come on, blue fly. I like noticing things. On the train jam, I was so badly flared that I couldn't focus on the conversation at dinner. But I kept noticing things out the window and calling them out like snow sparklies. Okay. I don't understand train jam. I feel like I missed a bit of a storyline there. So maybe we went too far ahead. Or maybe it's just random ramblings from the creator of this little game. Oh, before I forget, this game is available on itch.io. It's a free game. I can say it's really cute. There's another one. What do we have to say here? My biggest flaw is that I forget what stories I've already told. It makes me so embarrassed when I start telling the one I've ones I've already told. That's the same for me. It's like, you forget who you tell the stories to, and so sometimes you just really like a story. And you just want to share it again and again and again. It's really embarrassing. Or it's been a while and you just forgot. 
look at you. Any more? Yes. Oh, there's a blue one here. Where are you? Right here. Come on. Right over here. There you are. Boom. Well, we have seen it. You know, I used to read and read to try and find out what lightning bugs ate. Then I learned that the adults don't live long enough to eat. Oh, damn. They don't even have mouths. Holy shit, I didn't know that. That's kind of sad. So the, only the little babies ones live, live long enough to eat. It reminds me, there, when I lived in Indiana, at some point there were what looked like lightning bugs that didn't light up. And they would sting the shit out of you if you caught them. It made me really paranoid to catching lightning bugs. I think they must have been like some sort of wasp. They always seem to only show up like during the evenings. And I've gotten stung so many times hunting lightning bugs as a kid. What do you have to say? I have a friend. She is so lovely. She's kind and I know she has a heart inside of her, a hurt inside of her and I want to dig it out so badly. I can't dig everyone's hurt away. Aww. Sweet. What else we have? This is fun. I'm liking this. So pretty colors when you can catch it when you see them. Just little hints. It's gonna be a very dark video. Hello. Hello, family friend. I'm often too quick to be on mental damage. On mental damage control whenever I get my feelings hurt. I assume the reason for the hurt is silly, which often it is, and I can't write myself off so quickly. I have to get better at listening to myself. And I worded that really weirdly. I'm sorry. I wonder how many fireflies I've gotten so far. Hey. What about you? I gotta make choices here. Keep trying to press buttons, there's no point in that, because it's only a mouse room game. Hello. I saw a question once I said, how do you cheer up your friends when they are sad? Sometimes they don't need cheering up in these times. Sometimes they need someone to be patient and listen. Sometimes they need you to hold their hand to show that it's okay, that they don't want to talk about it, and that you love them. That's very true. It's almost daytime. Any more fireflies? No? I don't think they're gonna light up anymore, are they? Here we go. This is sweet. Any more? I can see him so clearly now. So I'm gonna play through like a second night of this just to see if there's any other sayings, what all, if there's any repeats or anything like that. It's very peaceful. Now we get a good look at all the colors and the background. I wonder if this background was done hand-painted? Oh, I managed to sketch that. Sometimes I feel like a side character in other people's stories. Like sometimes I wonder if the purpose of my doing something or having an adventure is to inspire someone else. Maybe they're the ones that will change the world and I just gave them the boost. I think I'm okay with this setup. I caught 97 lightning bugs and had 8 insights. That was lovely. Want to catch bugs and chat for another night? Yes, I do, actually. So let's go for that night two. Ooh. There's a bunch here. Here we go. We start off on the edge of the map this time. Opposite edge. Ooh. So many night or so many bugs tonight. There's a blue bug somewhere around here. Around in this area, I think. Where are you, friendly bug? No, he's over here. He's moving. Or maybe it's just my imagination. No, there's definitely... He's here. Right here. There we go. I was thinking about how to re... How red pandas have dark fur on their bellies. Most animals, when drawn as cartoons, are given light belly fur. You 
think there are data points on the percentage of mammals who I didn't catch the rest of that. I should have read it faster. I'm sorry. That was a lot of... Words to catch. There we go. Let's see if we can catch a few more. Or more than we did last night. Also, the backgrounds look a little different from last night. We're right around here. More insights can we get? you. I know you're here. There we go. I guess there wasn't a blue one there. There we go. Oh. Yeah, you are blue. You remember your dreams. I do, actually. I had a dream once about a Roomba, but instead of vacuuming, it drew pictures on the ground. Ha! That's cool. Most of my dreams, I'm trying to think of what the dream I had last night was. It was kind of really disjointed. I had a, been having a lot of stress lately. Helped a friend move out of a really abusive situation. What is the difference between saying nothing is impossible and saying anything is possible? That you can do th one means you feel you can do things, and the other one. Oh no, I see. Nothing is impossible. I don't think there's really a difference. One sounds a little bit more positive, I guess. Let's catch him. Yes, love Luke. Gotcha. I found a gray hair the other day, but don't worry. I was not distressed. It was silver and sparkly like unicorn hair. I'm going to have, a, have silver unicorn hair as a little lady, and it's going to be amazing. Nice. I'm blonde, so I'll probably just go white. Knowing my luck, I wouldn't mind having silver hair instead. That sounds like fun. I think I had a character once, back when I drew more regularly, it had silver hair. Like bright, shiny silver hair. She was an elf. I think I called her Whisper, or something like that. Oh, she, she went under a few different revisions, but she always had the silver hair. What are the ones we have here? La 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 la. La 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 la. I want to catch more. Come on. There we go. Oh, there's a blue one there. I think I caught it. Oh, there. I did caught it that time. Did you misplay something? Is there a chair in the room? Stand on your chair or lay on the floor on your tummy. It sounds ridiculous, but sometimes altering visual pers perspective helps. Yeah, yeah I guess. That yeah, makes sense. I guess there's a bunch of different ones. Uh, here we go. So daytime should be coming pretty soon. There's a blue one right here. I got you. There are times when I feel that empathy is a curse. That was a short one. Getting a little faster at this. <laughs> Being on, I'm on a big recording binge today. There's one game I'm not all that sure I'm actually gonna put up. It's kind of disturbing. It deals with a suicide in kind of a very brutal way. Yeah, it didn't... I don't know. I'll, I'll have to think about it. I'll make a decision when I go to edit it. It was... It wasn't a very... Fun game was kind of distressing to play. Oh, where are you? There you guys are. So many. Kind of cool if it if the jar would just kind of splash every now and then. Uh, where's my next ones? There you go. A bunch here. There we go. You're not this area. I must not have gone this way for a while. There we go. What other ones we got going here? It's getting late. I noticed one of the lights on my side of my screen went out. I miss you. Darn. I... Time. There we go. 
I was thinking about the fallibility of memory. It was when I was terribly fatigued and couldn't greet a friend with the energy I wanted. I remember myself as a high energy person. What if this memory is false? What if the person I am in my mind isn't real? What if indeed? It's kind of how I view myself. Like the other night, I was really tired at work and I thought I was acting pretty normal, but I guess not. People were like, you're always so bright and bouncy. I'm like, kind of normal? I mean, I'm tired. I wasn't bouncing. I, I don't know. Let's catch you. I want to catch you. Come on. No, I want to catch you instead. It's nice to be alone, but not really. It's nice to have another person sitting quiet, quietly and working that, that I could sit quietly next to and also work. I actually do that with a couple of my friends. It's really nice. Just hop on Skype. And we don't really talk. We'll, you know, random comment here and there, but for the most part, we just kind of bullshit around playing whatever game. Ah, the daylight's coming. Can't catch you until you flash. There we go. My dad always said that if you keep doing what you're doing, you'll keep getting what you're getting. It's always made me angry because it was true. It, it is especially difficult when what you're do, doing is yielding good results because life will often come and wrench that up so you have to change it anyway. That's true. Sometimes the hardest thing is changing yourself. Keeping up with those changes. in time for me to catch you, please? There we go. I have a game I play with a friend on days when I'm especially exhausted. We're down. I ask him to give me some words to help me face the day, and he will give me a list of random words, and I spend the day trying to find those words. Sometimes they spawn insights. I didn't report back with stories, and I didn't catch that one. Wow, I caught a bunch, and I had 10 insights. 108 lightning bugs. Alright. So there's the people responsible for the game, as well as some Patreon and special people, I guess. I hope you guys enjoyed. This has been a really fun and kind of relaxing game. The music's really nice. And I love the artwork. I know I, I don't know if I ever quite got it out right the first time, but I wonder if this is like hand-drawn. I'll have to look that up. Well, anyways, guys, until next time, I'll see you later. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. This was a really nice and relaxing game. I, I actually kind of enjoyed being able to just kind of chill out and ramble a little bit. Anyways, I want to say thank you so so much for 25 subscribers. Also, if you guys enjoyed this, I'd love to hear from you guys. Likes, comments, subscribe, you know the drill. And until next time, I'll see you.